Take two. So in the, in the fall of 1971, I started to, to, to work out a working prototype. I did it on uh, off hours in the, in the nights. The, the idea behind making a prototype was of course to see uh, if, we were, if we were also able to make a solution that worked satisfactorily for the supermarket, uh, that the customer liked it, and that it could be reproduced at a cost that the supermarket will accept. I remember the brush you were yes. brushing up yes. with. Because it looks so, so dull with just mm. the, the grey surface. So I took a little steel, uh, wool, steel wool, in the drill. And it's <laughs> one by one, no, yes. from. And uh, we, we presented this whole concept to this, uh, the bottle uh, committee. And they said, this is exactly what we want. What they wanted was one hole in the wall, one printed and calculated receipt with one deposit, complete deposit on, and to distinguish between non-deposit bottles. And that was a task. And in um, January, January 2nd, the day after New Year in 1972, we installed the prototype in Mr. Orge Fremsta's supermarket in Oslo. And then to install that machine and to learn that the customers, they love this clean and easy way to get rid of the deposit containers and getting reimbursed. At the same time, the supermarket owner said, this is my best investment. Then we understood Tumrai has a future. And it took a short time before companies came from different company, countries abroad. And that's when I challenged Peter and I said, if you can sell minimum of 15 units within the next months, I can skip my job and we can fully 100% go in for this company. <laughs> and this smart guy, he sold 15 machines in less than a month. <laughs>